What's up, you guys? Hey, everyone. Welcome back to our channel today. Oh, yeah. It's Costco day, baby. Yeah. He's just excited because we literally have no food in our house right now. <laughs> Zero. <laughs> and I want samples. Oh, my gosh. I don't know if they're doing samples yet. Oh. Our last Costco haul we did was out in Hawaii, which it also was our biggest Costco haul we've Massive. ever done. So if you're new here, make sure you go check out that haul. It's kind of fun to see what they had in Hawaii. But they had the food out, but no one could sample it. It was yeah. like May and a person was there, but no one could take it. It was kind of odd. I haven't seen that before, but here in Florida, we haven't been in a while. They haven't been doing them, but maybe they're doing them now. I don't know. We'll see. We will see. We need food. We need drinks. We need everything. We need all the stuff, and I'm kind of excited to see what pre-made meals they have right now as well, because those are my go-to things all the time as well. <laughs> so enough chit-chatting. Let's head in and shop. Alright, first stop, bath towels. <laughs> yeah, as you guys know, we go through towels really quickly because of all the desserts that we're constantly all having. Visitors, and <laughs> hey, I just had to stop. Could you try to get my towels from like Target or TJ Maxx, pieces like that? But I just saw the price eight bucks for a large bath towel. I feel like that's a pretty good deal. Yeah, that's a screaming good deal. Plus, they're super soft. Anything at Costco, you know, is going to be quality. So I think we're going to pick up a few of these. Okay, so we were just leaving the towel aisle and this caught my eye. I didn't even know Costco really sold lights, but look how cute this light fixture is. So it's a floor lamp. It has these cute three pendants. This one's really cute too with the white and black. Look what it looks like when it's actually lit up. I know, that's really awesome. So funny thing enough is that we've actually been talking about getting another floor lamp. We thought about going to lights.com because we've got everything else, but I mean this is... Uh, yeah, if this was gold I or like a brass and it matched ours, I would totally pick that up. And it's... 99 bucks. That yeah, is that awesome. Is okay, so we saw these candy grapes. We're wondering if these are kind of like the cotton candy grapes that I've heard of, but usually those are green. So let us know if you guys have tried these. favorite section is pre-made meals. I just saw this chicken salad. I've never tried this. I think we're gonna pick one of these up. Of course, we're gonna get our street tacos. This is absolutely one of our favorite meals here to get. And then I actually need to pick up dinner for a friend as well. So I'm thinking of doing the chicken alfredo or the mac and cheese. Which one, Jared? Mmm, I don't know. They both look really good. Maybe the Alfredo? Yeah, that looks pretty good. This is new. I haven't seen this before. Italian sausage and garlic white wine sauce. This That's looks really, really good. good. These are enchiladas. Those actually sound really good. Yeah, Maybe these actually look bomb. I oh, know. my gosh, and red bagoli. And this is new too. Meatloaf with mashed potatoes. Oh, boy. cakes with cream cheese frosting. They look pretty good. They're not that many. I mean, look at my hand. They're pretty big. I'm tempted to try one of these, but let me know if you've had these. I might get them for Easter. Samples, samples. baby. We got a chicken sausage, meatball. Mm-hmm. Thank you. And check this out. I did not know Costco even did this. These are ribs right here. So usually they have the rotisserie chicken, which of course we got one of those, but they also have ribs. Oh uh, my yes, gosh. please. So good. These are one of our favorite go-to snacks, the little mozzarella packs. Oh, they come in a pack of yeah. three. One of our absolute faves. Okay, I have never seen this before. I wonder if this is only a Florida thing, but this is Chapino. This is one of my favorite dishes when we go to Italian restaurants, but they have this now in the store. It actually looks pretty good. I'm kind of tempted to try it. Yes, I mean, I make homemade cinnamon rolls. But, but I, I mean, pull aparts. We may have to try it. Pre-made. Yeah, we may have, have to try, try it. Though. Hey, this is new too. I've seen this going around TikTok, but this is the Mediterranean feta dip. So there's tomato, basil, garlic, and chive, and cilantro. This looks so good. Okay, 
Okay, if you guys have not tried this, this is one of my favorite things, the Spray Dawn dish soap. Literally game changer. Okay, we got the classic water, we got paper towels, we got detergent. I picked up some frozen chicken as well. Got quite a few pre-made meals, salsa. This may not be our largest haul, but it's getting pretty big pretty quick. Yeah, and it <laughs> may be our most delicious haul. Yes, I am so excited. <laughs> I will that. say that. Seriously, the pre-made meals here at Costco are so good and it takes like zero effort. I make. know. So for someone like me to eat it on the go, it's, it's awesome. It's awesome. We also just picked up some of this mango salsa. We've had their other mango salsa, but this one, this is a new one. So yeah, interesting one to see really how we like that. Our all time go-to is always the Jack's Cantina salsa. Mm -hmm. This is our fave too. And we also picked up some curries. We got a chicken tiki masala. This one's a new one, chicken coconut curry with mango. Oh yeah, so these bad boys with our rice. Yeah, Ooh. so good. Jared just found it looks like a new type of maple syrup, vanilla bean infused. Ooh. Ooh, that looks good. We may need to try that. Okay, I've never seen these before. These are cinnamon churro strips. Jared. What? Yes. I think we may need to try uh, those. Yeah. Wow. Oh, wow. That looks amazing. <laughs> hey, just saw these pet treats. This is bacon nutty sausage to PB and bacon recipe. They're all natural ingredients. So I think I might pick up some of these for Finn. Okay, this is one of our absolute favorite. The Korean barbecue jerky. So, so good. Okay, picking up our favorite protein drink. The muscle chocolate milk. muscle oh, yeah. milk. So we include this in all of our protein shakes in the morning and they are delicious. Yes. It's like the secret ingredient. That with a little peanut butter, banana, spinach, ice, you're set. We're running out of room, you guys. All right, you guys, this is quite the beast of a haul. This is like our fourth like unload and we still have quite a bit more left to get. I will say my one pet peeve about shopping at Costco and especially living inside of an apartment complex is that you gotta do tons of hauls in order to get your stuff from your car into your apartment complex. Luckily, we had a couple of those boxes that we've used, but we still have so many loose items that we have to go down and pick. So while I'm getting the remaining stuff, Brittany's back upstairs, organize everything in the fridge, cabinets, and whatnot. And I have to still have to get the bigger items like the waters, the paper towels, other drinks we got, man. There's a lot to get out here. One quick funny thing is that the parking up here was all full, and so, ironically, we had to park in one of the last spots. <laughs> and so, we have to take all of this stuff way back there, up the elevator, to our place, and then had to do that like four or five times, so. We're getting there, guys. Jared working his magic. Yeah. You guys, this is where everything you see happens. I this know. is his little editing stand. I, I, right I, I actually have to laugh because I think a lot of people feel like you have like a big monitor or this big fancy no. computer, but it's. I just have this computer and just get a little, his little old. laptop. Oh. <laughs> I, I actually got this computer in 2016. Oh my gosh. So obviously, I need another one pretty soon here. I know the buttons are like falling off. He has like this plastic cover that kind of covers them I to know. help. I actually they don't, have to but vacuum the keyboard quite a bit. <laughs> yes, yeah, speaking of that, this yeah. is actually a mini vacuum. Yes, yeah, so this is actually my mini vacuum cleaner, but it's super convenient. So this is the button to turn on, pretty self-explanatory. There's a high and low setting that you can change right here. I usually just do low because it's good enough. Unless I'm in the car, then I use high. But it actually holds quite a bit, so you flip this thing out. Press this down and then you can open it up and that's how you empty it out. Isn't that so cool? Yeah. We use this thing for lots of different things. So I know. I use it on my keyboard quite a bit. Yeah. So let me just show you. It's charging, but I'm sure it has enough battery. Let's turn it on. Yeah. Isn't that awesome? Yeah, it's pretty strong for how little it is. And then I use it usually right here. Yeah, it gets in like all those tiny little spaces. That drives me nuts when my computer gets all dusty. I just feel like this comes in handy so much for those oh, yeah. like little yeah. places you hate That's reaching. That's not all. 
Hold on, I actually keep the attachments in here, but <laughs> <laughs> it does come with a bunch of other attachments in case you guys are interested in getting it. We got it on Amazon. This is like for a car or for like pets, sorry, pet fur. Yes, this luckily like this little guy is hyperallergenic so we don't have too much fur around. And then this one's an extender. So say for example, I wanted to get like a hard reach spot. So sometimes I do that in between the car seats, yep. which is really hard to get, so I extend it out. It's yeah. been awesome. I feel like this is our favorite little new gadget that we found I know. and it's have really been cool. loving it's it. Made by a company called Afuzi, I believe that's how you pronounce it. Afuzi. Uh, but honestly, it's awesome. It comes in white and black for graphite, and this is the color that I got, and I love it. Yep. I think we matches the computer. Uh, Check it out. Yeah, I think we may need to get a second one and just keep one of these in the car. I know, I often, we keep getting it yeah, back and forth, I and know. it's like, where is it? And anyways, we do have a promo code for this. $10 off, we'll put it here on the screen and then a link for it down below in case you guys want to check it out. We did open up these cinnamon chips, these churro strips, and they are really good. Mm -hmm. And yeah, they're delicious. paleo and vegan. This is the other thing that we love, you guys. These are popcorners. <laughs> now, the first time I actually ever tried these was actually on a flight, on a JetBlue flight to Utah. If you guys have not tried these before, definitely go out and get this. Yes. These things are so good. And that's the kettle corn kind. Mm -hmm. So delicious. Speaking of Costco, you guys, I actually just ended up eating some of the ribs that we got. So as you guys know, we got the rotisserie chicken and the ribs. I will be honest, the ribs weren't that great. I no, personally, they were not good at all. Yeah, I personally did not like them. Britt didn't like them. And so I don't think we would recommend those. I think I was just so excited to eat the ribs because we recently went out to dinner with Brandon and we had ribs and they were delicious. Delicious. Yeah, and so I was like totally anticipating that same delicious taste, but yeah, definitely not not there. But these <laughs> ones from Costco, they didn't really have sauce. They had like a rub on them, and yeah. I put barbecue sauce on them, yeah. trying to help out with it, just to make them like I don't know taste better. It was very it. fatty, and so that's definitely not what you want, in ribs. It didn't work out. So yeah, yeah not out. super impressed there. <laughs> this little guy, <laughs> I think he missed us a little oh, bit. Oh, a little tired. He's I tired. think we need to take him out on a little walk before we. I know. Hit the old hay here. Feels good to have everything stocked back up for the it most part. It feels good to open up the fridge and actually see food. Yes. Oh my gosh. It's been a while. It's been a while since we've seen food, drinks, anything like that. I think I just also was putting off going to Costco because I went so many times out in Hawaii yeah. for that trip. Mm -hmm. I was just kind of Costcoed out. I mean, I sometimes you just get tired yeah, of it after I you know. go and go and go. But I was stoked to see samples there. There was tons of samples yes. and we ate all of them. Yes, we did. <laughs> we do have some fun plans. I think tomorrow there's a new place in Florida we want to go check out that we have mm -hmm. never been before. Well, that place is actually coming up probably on Wednesday or Thursday. Oh, yeah, sorry, Wednesday tomorrow Thursday. we actually have some car stuff that we have to do and a lot of you guys have been asking us about the car camera. We still have not yet installed that. I'm still kind of putting that off. I really haven't had the time yet to do it. But I am going to be doing it, so it should be pretty good. <laughs> so our tint on the back window is all bubbly and yeah, it, it's old and it, it, it just, just needs to get It's replaced. hard to even like look through the rear view mirror. I know. So it's even worse with a bad backup camera. It's kind of crazy, but I think just from the heat on it so much, that's what caused it, right? After I think so. so long. But we even had that out in Utah, so we've had that out yeah. here for a long time. Yeah, so he's gonna go take that to get fixed tomorrow. We have a few other things. I also am calling my doctor tomorrow. We will be updating you on a bunch of stuff there coming up shortly so kind of lots on the to-do list tomorrow for the yeah. most part we're just trying to get a bunch of things done it because as you guys know we have visitors coming a week from today guys that is oh gosh, crazy a week from be, today they're gonna be here I know, I was just actually and it's on, gonna be a full house yeah I was on the phone with them earlier today we were planning out a few different things that they want to do and see and it should be a ton of fun so if you guys are new to our channel definitely hit that subscribe button right now because we have tons of fun adventures planned and coming your way all right you guys I think with that we're gonna go ahead and end the vlog we love you so much and until next time we'll see you later bye, bye.